These are five paediatric rashes that you must know as medical students. Number one is measles. It often starts with coplic spots and then you have the three C's. Cough, chorizal symptoms, conjunctivitis and associated fever. Often starts behind the ears, the rash spreads down the body and it's something that you cannot miss. It's actually a notifiable disease. Number two is rubella. One of those risky conditions in pregnancy. So because of the risk of congenital rubella. It starts with a fine salmon coloured kind of pinky rash and then it spreads usually associated with with post auricular lymphadenopathy as well. Thirdly, scarlet fever. Group A streptococcus, classic cause, starts with a sore throat, horizontal symptoms, strawberry tongue, often associated as well with a fever that prolongs for some days. There's a risk of renal damage and renal impairment in patients with scarlet fever if untreated, but you need to make sure antibiotics are started soon and it's penicillin V that needs to be given. Then you have chickenpox. Chickenpox contagious, needs to be isolated, and it's the various stages of the rash that are often assessed in exams, whether it's the early sort of macules that you tend to see, the papules or the vesicles or then the later crusting. Chickenpox is a condition that you should really know how to pick up and detect. Number five is slap cheek syndrome. The bright red rash across the face, sometimes a bit of an eruption on the arms as well, but the cause is parvovirus B19. Again, risky in pregnancy and there's a risk of aplastic anemia crisis. If you found this useful or for more tips, tricks, whiteboard medicine to help you smash your exams, check out our seven day free trial at mediclaunch.com.